Oh, man. All right. Well, we are here for uh, GDP Live's uh, first ever legitimate Christmas spelling bee. This is the spelling bee to end all spelling bees. It was a challenge uh, thrown down originally and supposed to have been squashed uh, on Black Friday, but was not squashed at all. And uh, Mr. Jonathan Monataga. Monataga. Has, <laughs> has, uh, since I squeaked out a win, as he likes to put it, but I crushed him in the uh, original spelling bee. He wants to redeem himself and hopefully maybe somehow one day be able to, to face his child uh, and look her in the eye. Uh, so, John, I would uh, I would like to say welcome to uh, the first ever Christmas Spelling Bee. Yeah. How are you doing today? I'm doing good. Thanks for having me. Uh, thanks for agreeing for there to be a real point system this time. That's cool. Uh, Pat <laughs> won by a fraction of like a point if you look at the, the last time. one. I definitely was not against it the first time. We just we just, just too much thinking. We're both very dumb, and we need somebody way, 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 way smarter than us to, to uh, moderate it. And that's why we've invited Manti Santiago. <laughs> way Manti. smarter? Oh. Way smarter. Wow. Way smarter. Not, and also, I was really nice. hoping you were going to set that up and be like, and we need somebody way smarter. But and, we could only get. <laughs> but also, but also, None of them were available. <laughs> Uh, All of them here. had families that love them around the holiday season. <laughs> of uh, Falls Count Anywhere fame, of uh, wonderful Boy in His Fridge fame, yes. uh, of wonderful stand-up comedy, and overall juggling magnificence. Welcome yeah. to the show, buddy. Thank you so much for being here and, and uh, coming up with a, a wide uh, slarth of words for us. Slarth? I think, is that a That's word? That's not a word. Sloth? I think it's well, sleuth. It's sleuth? called think... sloth. There's one right next to me. Oh, so, <laughs> oh I, nice. I didn't know we got one for Christmas. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but uh, thank you so much for being here and moderating and scoring uh, the, the first ever and f hopefully final because I want to put this to bed and I want to put you in the fucking ground, John. Oh, I thought we had a lot of fun and we could keep doing this like every holiday. Oh, yeah. but, no, or, that's what I saying. mean, there's always that too. That's why, that's why Manny's here. I want to I wanna cook this up. Ah, oh, so we can get the Spanish holidays, too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See you on May 5th, bitch. <laughs> Manny, uh, thanks for being here. How are, you, yeah. how are you doing today, buddy? I'm uh, I'm good. I'm happy to be here. I, I enjoyed the first. I don't know where to look because Pat is right across from me, <laughs> but he's also yeah. in, Manny, the, in the corner of the screen. <laughs> you're, yeah, Manny, we're, you know we're where to look. Yeah. You know where the moneymaker is. Just focus right here, baby. Yeah. Oh, oh I, I looked right at Pat when he said that. <laughs> Damn it. He knows where the money makers are. <laughs> Honestly, I know you want there to be a bunch more, but that's because you crushed me in the first one. So, but we were picking the words and, and obviously uh, yeah. there I wasn't as many words of the day deep. Yeah. So yeah, and Manny is. I did in, notice in, that. I did notice know. that you guys were were you know using words that you guys picked, and yeah, because uh, I watched I watched the first one and I really enjoyed it. That yeah, I you I remember you specifically. The reason I asked you. Not only because you're a friend of the show, you're yeah. a very funny guy, and I trust your judgment truly, Thank you. but also because there is a you were actually one of the people that brought up the fact that like is this show just you guys spelling stuff now <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> because like <laughs> I've done it a couple of times, and you're just like not like hey, I'm here for it, yeah, I like it, yeah, but like is that what this show is because I need to know so I can prepare yeah. so uh but i I do appreciate you taking the uh, time out and uh it's cool being on it's like yeah. being on one of your one of your like one of the shows that you watch you know what I mean it's like man I wish I could be on that show and then you you're on it not only it's that, the Christmas miracle guys but, but you're you're ruling this bitch I'm so, fucking running I, shit I got I tell a sword. You what, the one thing we do have we have established and we did this over group text uh since GDP live was uh we decided the stakes literally. John, do you want to tell them what we're playing for today? Oh, because there. we don't understand that uh, certain words are spelled different ways. For instance, steak could be spelled S-T-E-A-K on the hat, or it could be spelled S-T-A-K. We don't know the difference. So we're playing for actual steaks. Yes. Actual we're talking steaks. meat. We're talking delicious American meat. I don't trust any of that foreign Japanese Wagyu I can't afford. No, no. Uh, Omaha? Omaha steaks? Is that America? Omaha? Isn't that the Nebraska? place? Nebraska? Was, was that the place that was bombed on, on, on D-Day? Wait, yes. Do you think it's from Omaha Beach? <laughs> Wait, is that your Omaha? <laughs> Omaha Beach, like your Omaha? <laughs> yeah, yeah, of course. Was that our Omaha or their Omaha? <laughs> 
Cat gets booked at a comedy club in Omaha, and he's like, I mean, I got to update my passport. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if I'm okay driving. I mean, yeah, driving there. I'm honored to take this job. Thank you for having me in your country. <laughs> what highway do I take to get there? <laughs> Uh, do you have any steaks here? <laughs> uh, uh, how do you get you steaks in a box frozen? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, uh, grade A uh, USDA meat. We're playing for steaks. The steaks are steaks. Do I get any steak? Twenty dollars. Twenty dollars steaks. Yeah, you get a, you'll, you'll get a steak. Do I only get a steak if Pat wins? Because <laughs> I'll share my meat with you. Yeah. Wow, John, are you going to share your meat with me if you win? No, but it, what sucks is whatever I do win, I probably have to get like two smaller steaks because if I just come home and eat steak while quarantined and don't get one for my wife, she will fucking murder me. <laughs> that was so funny. I won this. What? <laughs> yeah. Where's the steak uh, that you won? Yeah. You I mean you don't have that. you don't have meat bets with your friends? <laughs> <laughs> Look, if you want to get a steak. Make meat bets with your friends and win them. <laughs> it's that like, easy. Yeah. What do I got to do? Spell words correctly and you'll get meat. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, uh, Manny, I don't know exactly how you want to uh, score this or, or if you thought about that at all. Well, um, I mean, I was just going to do, if you spell the word right, you get a point. Okay. Hey, that's <laughs> that that's fair to simple. me. The way it should have been scored. <laughs> now, do you guys want to do it where you guys both get different words or you guys both get the same word and whoever spells it right gets a point? Or whoever, I guess if you guys both spell it right, you would both get a point there. We but, can wait, no, I just, can I just say that would be too hard because then it, you can't buzz in or anything. Like, if we both spell it right and – we both spell it wrong. I feel yeah. like that's how we go two hours. <laughs> okay, so, so so to make it like an actual spelling bee, you guys all, all will both get different words. Yeah, so. and, and, yeah. and you can and, pick, you pick them however you want to pick them. Yeah. Don't and to be like an actual spelling bee, I'm identifying as an 11 year old Indian boy. <laughs> you know what's funny is I was telling Pat before this. Uh, I looked up like some of the like hardest words to spell or whatever, and like in like the spelling bee, and I yeah. found like this list, and it had all the spelling bee winners or whatever, uh -huh. and literally every single name <laughs> was an Indian name. <laughs> Which, ironically enough, the hardest thing to spell at the spelling bee is, is their, names. their names. Yeah, <laughs> actually, that's so. That's like being that's like being born with a fucking weighted vest. Yeah. They're, they're just waking up, knowing how to spell awesome, great, hard names. Yeah, and and that's how just how cool would it be if it came down to like an Indian kid and just like a white girl, and they're like, "All right, curveball, spell Raj's last name." <laughs> yeah. like, oh my god, they've been saying it the him. whole time. So, 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 so I did have the I did have this idea where uh, if there's a tie or if there's like a bonus or whatever, I was gonna do. You guys would have to spell uh, winners of oh my god <laughs> the spelling bees for the pat from the past like ten years because I, 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 I have them. The, that's how the we most letters hours. correct. <laughs> yeah, I can't even say like half of their names. So. <laughs> the first round is brought to you by just bourbon. Okay. Whoa! Oh my god, that's bourbon. Bit. The whole glass is bourbon. Yeah, you sip it, Penny. I get responsible adult. Do I don't drink John? liquor. I don't drink liquor. Do you uh, think John's sipping it? No. That's a, <laughs> that glass was full when we first started talking to him. So uh, you wanted to, while, while we were, uh, before, actually, we got started, you wanted to give a quick uh, demonstration for the, uh, the people out there. If you're playing along at home, grab yourself a nice glass, put some bourbon in, but then also, get festive, let's add some eggnog. Whoa. And not just any eggnog. That's good old fashioned Wawa eggnog. I looked up the instructions to make a bourbon eggnog, stopped reading after the ingredients, so I have no clue on the amount. So we're gonna play a little game of Manny, tell me when that's enough eggnog. Okay, it's gonna be overflowing in the cup, by the way. <laughs> just a, there's also a, a lag too. You're like, stop, stop, yeah. stop, stop, stop. stop. <laughs> now, I already have some bourbon in there. I don't well, even know if I like eggnog. First. I don't think you're supposed to do that, but guess what doesn't uh, mix well? Bourbon. Bourbon and eggnog. <laughs> Always stir with a finger. That's what the professionals say. A little bit of cinnamon. Ooh, don't take the top off. That's <laughs> <how you're laughs> don't take the top off the shaker of it's cinnamon that you're about top. to pour it. <laughs> so now a dash. If you were to take the, that's a lot. Damn it. If you were to take the top off. And again, stir with your finger. Nice. So that's John's cocktails. Back I'm to happy. you, Pat. <laughs> I'm happy that we got that. Also, uh, you wanna you don't want to drink on empty stomach. 
make sure you have an Uncrustable, Andy. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> this spelling bee is brought to you by Uncrustables. Is that great? U-N-C-R-U-S-T-A-B-L-E-S. Let's get to the spelling. I'm really uh, mad I don't have it because I'm wearing my Clark Griswold commemorative jersey. I'm mad I don't have a uh, Wally the Moose uh, mug from oh, Christmas yeah. Vacation. I just mixed two movie titles there. I'm drunk. Let's do this. Yeah, right. there we go. <laughs> Even that... Oh. What the fuck? Give me no words. No glasses. I'm not a nerd. You going first, John? Yes. All right. Are you ready for your first? The first word is. <laughs> are you ready for your first word, John? And I'm allowed to ask you in a sentence. Like, what's the? Yeah, you can ask me. Not in a how sentence. to spell it, though. Not how to spell it. Don't yeah. forget that. But, right. but you might be able to get me on. <laughs> yeah. Um, all right. I'm gonna try. <laughs> okay uh john we're gonna start a little easy we're gonna kind of ease into this you know we're gonna we're gonna make it we don't want to start off with the fucking you know super califragilistic yet you know what i'm saying s-u-p-e-r um, nope don't already you wrong <laughs> <laughs> um all right john your first word to spell because it is christmas john spell the word tinsel I'm writing it out so so yeah, write great. it out. Do whatever you got. Can he write it out in a sentence? <laughs> yeah, right, right. Right. You have to write a sentence with tinsel in it. <laughs> I just remembered too that uh, cinnamon and cinnamon sugar are two totally different things. That's why this tastes terrible. <laughs> just which, <laughs> which one you got? <laughs> just yeah. <down> cinnamon. <laughs> <laughs> okay. um, you know what tinsel. I heard? It tastes really good. Is if you pour a whole tablespoon and, and then just, just yeah. eat it. Try that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, tinsel. <laughs> T I N S E L tinsel. John, that is correct. You get a point. Fuck, Score really? For the good guys. T I N S E L. Now wait, yes. can we do? Since Pat what? did the fuck, really? Can we do what Pat thought it was? Yeah, I know what Pat thought it was. He thought it was L E and not E L. Ah, uh-uh. okay, What did you think? T I N S I L. Oh, tinsel. Like tonsil. Tinsel. <laughs> but- hey. Give me some tinsel and put it on the tree. Thank you. Oh, man. Yeah, I thought he was going to be, because Pat seems like the kind of guy that spells laser with a Z. I thought he was going to go tinsel. Dude, <laughs> honestly, it's half and half, okay? Sometimes it is a Z. Sometimes it is When I made that image for uh, GDP this morning, I had to look up how to spell laser. Thank I was like, is it a Z? Or am I just not that different, you and I, my friend. You know, <laughs> you know I, didn't, I didn't, like, react to it when you said it, but I honestly <laughs> thought laser was spelled with a Z, too. <laughs> We're all in the same room. We're basically no, we in the same room. we just all grew up going to laser tags and strip holes. Yeah. That's why <laughs> they spelled it wrong. Pat. Yeah. Since John, I would like to. Uh, I would like to go next. You would like to go <laughs> next. Okay. Pass. You just pass the whole time. Pass. <laughs> I would like to respectfully pass. Uh, Pat. Yeah. The- oh, that's it. Yes. <laughs> Spell Pat. <laughs> Wait, <what is laughs> That'd be so funny if I had all John's words like super hard and then your words were like the easiest ones and you still got them wrong. I would, I would overthink it. Would... Yeah. All right, Pat, your word is chimney. Ooh. Because I... Santa comes down the chimney. I'm writing it down. Can, just... I... Ooh, can we ever steal? Like if he spells it wrong. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> You think in an actual the one I know? He's gonna take the one I know. Wouldn't this be funny if in an actual spelling bee? <laughs> They're like, uh, can I actually spell that one? Can I take that one? Yeah, oh, I what? assume there's a money in the bank option. Yeah. In spelling Raj doesn't right? really know that one. I could tell I can see it in his eyes. I'm gonna take this one if that's okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna say, uh, Manny, if I may. You better. It's gonna be C H. I M N E Y. Pat. Yes, that is correct. Fuck. Oh man. Yeah. Did you? <laughs> did did you Can I tell you what Joel I thought it was? <laughs> yes. I thought it was. <laughs> I thought it was chimney. For yeah. I was thinking because I've heard people jokingly pronounce it chimney. Um. Oh, wow, guys. First hey, word. Todd. <laughs> give yourself. Give yourself hey, a round of applause. Good showing, guys. Give yourselves a round hey, of applause. You want to call? You want to call it now and just buy our own steaks? <laughs> <laughs> it's a tie. Just end on a tie. Honestly, yeah. If this is a draw. This is good. I feel good about this. <laughs> um, those were actually the only two words I had. So. <laughs> oh, yes. uh, all right, John. All right, John. Your next word is 